Hi, it's Monday. Happy Monday. It's June 2nd. Today's a very special day because it's my hubby's birthday. Happy birthday, love. Um, he is 41 today. Uh, he still acts like he's 12. Um, what? Mention your what? Okay. Marissa. <laughs> <laughs> is interrupting my video. Uh, Rissa is learning how to cook and her specialty is scrambled eggs. So that's what she's making herself for lunch. I made myself this and it is uh, why it's a uh, bird's eye steam fresh wild and brown rice with peas and carrots and then uh, four ounces of chicken breast just started pouring down rain outside um, four ounces of chicken breast and then two tablespoons of Italian light Italian dressing and a tablespoon of Parmesan cheese and you mix it all together and it is good oh my goodness um, so yeah that's what I'm having for lunch I think the whole this that whole great big bowl was like I think it's I want to say it's like 400 calories and it's lots of fiber it's healthy protein low in fat very very good so yeah um yeah i uh, i'm feeling better i'm sorry i haven't made a video but the last couple weeks have been rough i was on two different kinds of antibiotics i had to go to the hospital uh when i first my i showed you my arm um and then i went to the doctor and she put me on antibiotics she put me on Leviquin and it got, it started getting a little better, but then it just stopped and it started getting worse again. And I also had, um, one, on uh, one on my leg. So I ended up going, I went back to the doctor. She sent me to the hospital. Uh, they had turned into abscesses. I had to have them drained. It was so, so incredibly painful. It was awful. Awful. Uh, I was really lucky hush that my sister and my husband were there with me because it was bad um so the doctor put me on another antibiotic so i was on two he put me on clind clindamycin so i was on the levoquin and the clindamycin and it kicked my butt um i wasn't allowed to exercise <clears throat> excuse me and all i wanted to do was sleep so I tried to keep eating healthy and I did fairly well um, and then when I was allowed to start exercising of course the first day I did too much and um, wore myself out and then I don't know it, so anyway um, Marissa is very distracting she is off school. Thursday was her last day. Um, Where's that ketchup? In the fridge. I can't find it. No, it's right there in front of your face. Ketchup is evil. You're weird. Anyway. <laughs> um, sorry. This is so distracting. Okay, please go away. Please feature it. <sighs> These are Rissa's eggs, and she covers them with ketchup. Bye, ketchup. Mm. Ah. away now. Okay, bye. Got to work the cleaner. Bye. Bye. I can't edit this on my mom's laptop. I don't know how. So, <laughs> yeah. Anyway, today uh, I'm feeling better. I am almost completely healed. I am still on the clindamycin. Um, but I'm doing lots better and I've been able to exercise more and yeah. So today was my weigh in day and I weighed in last week and I lost, I lost two pounds. So I have it all in my, my new journal that I'm keeping. Um, my first weigh in was, uh, May 5th and I weighed 487.8. So my goal for the month of May was to lose 15 pounds. Last week, I weighed, last Monday, I weighed 475.4. Four. 
which was a 2.2 pound loss and it brought me to 12.4 pounds lost so far. T today I weighed in and I weighed 470.4 so I lost 5 pounds. Wow! And it brought my weight loss for the month of May to 17.4 pounds. So it's almost 17 and a half pounds. So I hit my goal and then some. And I think that's pretty awesome considering I couldn't exercise for almost two weeks. And I was on all that medicine. And yeah, so I'm very, very happy with that. And I decided that for the month of June, I'm going to go ahead and aim for 15 again. Why not? Um, pretty much keeping all my goals, exercise every day, uh, journal on my food, uh, stay in my targets, and see what I can do. I'm feeling really good, very proud of myself, and thank you all for your love and support. It's very, very much appreciated, and I hope you're having a great Monday, and I'll talk to you all soon. Bye.